Yeah, so I just got a random package from Hasbro. <clears throat> That'll work. And, uh, I know I did tell them, like, hey, I... One of my figures I had just bought was having QC issues. But in case this is a thing of, hey, look, here's this. Oh. They full-on just replaced it. So, thank you, Hasbro, for the lovely support getting this shipped out and fixed because my original copy that I wanted to do a small little review on had yeah it's the arm is locked in place unless I jam something into the joint which even then it's like extremely hard and out of the box it had stress marks so, can you see the arm is not supposed to be full out out. As well as I just won the tri or the Stegosaurus, so that will be a video coming out in the near future. And let's see. I have the same issue. No. Wait. No. It is a much better figure. Oh, okay. Cold on the plastic, though. But that is give expected, given it is a cold day outside. All the joints seem to be working absolutely perfectly. The neck joint's a little tight though, it's probably just a good bit of rotating, it will loosen it. Because it is a ball joint. There we go. I do like these. Okay. This would be our accessories. We have a pterodactyl power coin, a bow that if I go ahead and grab Trini, I could pull her power daggers out of her hand. And I can full on clip them in. Being honest, has bro, this was like an. And I'm saying, I think the paint on the belt is actually perfect on this one. Yeah, because I got like scuffs on that one. But on that one, that's like perfect. I think they really threw this through the QC line just to make sure it met standards. Which I've had to file reports like transformers and stuff in the past. Like my conversion kit Optimus Prime from Power of the Primes getting two left legs for the Optimus mode. Also, I wish these came with, like, Funko stands to allow them to stand easier. Also, I love the little backdrops you get for these. But, yeah. Hasbro QC is definitely on their game. I 
I gotta admit, I'm actually very happy with Hasbro right now. And picking up the Power Rangers one was actually a really good thing. Despite what a lot of people saying about the shows that they're putting out. But I would love to actually work with Hasbro on doing more. I don't know if I'll ever get that big. But, yeah. I gotta say, I'm actually really happy with Hasbro's customer support. Definitely one of the better customer supports that I have worked with ever. Well, that is going to be it. I hope you all did enjoy it, and I'll catch you on the next one. This part is going up on edited anyways.